Hello and welcome to another episode of What's Inside. Today we are looking at a couple packs of uh, Milestone, the Dakota Universe trading cards. Uh, Milestone was an imprint used by DC Comics. It was, uh, I think, a creator-owned series. I don't know if DC owns the characters outright now. Uh, I think they do. Uh, but these were produced by Skybox in 1993. The line uh, never really caught on. It was popular for a little while, but um, it was one of those uh, um, uh, minority-run uh, universes where uh, people were creating characters for minorities that um, they wanted to see portray them, I guess. Uh, but yeah, some of the comics were actually really good. Uh, I'd liked, uh, what, three or four of them for a while and uh it just kind of faded away that i don't think it got supported properly or advertised or marketed quite right they tried really hard with it but it it just never hit i think it was just a uh, might have some of it might have been a little ahead of its time but let's open these up and see what is in these cards uh skybox has always done pretty good with the cards in, in the 90s so let's see what we've got here it's foily and fancy. These are, ooh, these are high-end cards. All right, cool. All right, so we've got Edwin Alva, card number 35. Uh, card number 61, The Big Bang. Card number 24, Icon. Card number 67, Baraka, Baraki Young. Uh, then card number 53, Lysistra Jones. Card number 23, Blood Syndicate. Card number 56, Static vs. Hot Streak. Uh, Static had his own cartoon for a while, not that long ago. Uh, card number 63, Rocket and Static. Uh, the card quality is really good. Uh, they do have kind of that weird dated 90s edge work to them and some of the art is not my style but it's pretty good like this is really good i like that um that's a very 90s outfit um uh, icon's costume looks really cool here but the the edge work makes it a little too little too 90s all right let's look at our other pack here real quick All right, we've got card number 19, Icon and Rocket. And then we've got Blood Syndicate 3, card number 12. That's a puzzle piece. It's part of a larger picture, obviously. Uh, card number 70, Estelle Jackson. Card number 9, Icon 9. That's another puzzle piece. And then we've got Virus, card number 30. Wilt Johnson, card number 98. Jimmy Palmetti, card number 81, and Kwai, card number 93. Now, on the back, we do have little blurbs. It's about a paragraph long. General information about the characters, or the storyline, that sort of thing. Uh, pretty cool. Really nice quality cards. Simplistic layout. I like that. Easy to read. Very good. Very nice quality cards overall. Very, very impressive. They've held up amazingly well. They're on thicker card stock, higher quality, much like the Marvel Universe uh, 2 and 3, or 1, 2, and 3 cards were. So these are definite musts for uh, pop culture fanatics, especially people that are interested in more obscure comic characters. These characters really need to be brought back in some regard because there was some really good stuff there that I think is going to waste not being published. So... Yeah, if you're interested in Milestone or what they're calling the Dakota Universe, these are really cool collectible. Uh, the card quality is amazing. Skybox did good work. I, I highly recommend these. But that'll do it for this episode. As always, thank you so much for watching and supporting the channel. And we hope to see you on the next episode of What's Inside.